So to install Azure CLI on your Windows computer, you could bring up the documentation, download the installer, and give yourself click fatigue going through it, or we could use PowerShell. Let's do that. So I got the download file here, setting that to my downloads folder. Then we use invoke web request to download that MSI so that URL you see there, that's the same one I got from the Microsoft documentation. And then once it's finished downloading, I'm going to use uh, MSI exec to install it. But you notice I'm using the start process command to do this, and that's so they can use the wait parameter. So that when I actually run this, it will wait to return back to the prompt until it is installed. And this takes a couple of minutes for it to get installed. All right, once the installation process has completed, I'll go ahead and start up a new PowerShell window and bring it over here. So now we can access the Azure command line using the AZ prefix here. So we just type it once, there we go. And then of course we can log in using AZ login, which opens up a web browser. Go ahead and select our account. There we go, we're logged in. So that's how you install the Azure CLI on your Windows computer.